Good morning. It's Rosalie with Can't Wait to Plan. I am ex so excited to show you a haul, a huge haul that I did at, uh, did some major damage at Hobby Lobby yesterday. I actually went to two of the locations that's closest to my home. They're about 20 minutes from my house, um, both ways. And um, I got a lot of stuff. I got invitation galore. Uh, this particular Hobby Lobby location had a whole bunch of, I mean, they only had like one or two each or whatever, but they had a whole bunch of invitations that um, I can't wait to share with you. I'm so excited. Um, it's it's like I, I make cards as well. So it's um, it's really a blessing to find these. I, I bought a bunch from Michael's when they had their clearance sales, but that was nothing in comparison to these. Um, and then I bought basically every paper crafting kit um, that they recently reduced to six dollars um, and this week they have it for 50 percent off so i literally went to both store and pick out all of the one that um, they have that you know so combining um, and i think there was about maybe 30 different kits that I bought and I plan to keep. Uh, they're gorgeous. So I probably have to do that on the second haul, but let me go through this with you, okay? So first I'm gonna go through a couple of things that um, I bought from the jewelry section. I saw some people hauling a few of these and I just thought they were so sweet. So I decided to um, go ahead and get some. And um, let me see. So I got these at clearance. They were, I, they didn't say how much it was before, but I assume it was like $5.99. These are actually made in Uganda. Super pretty. Um, and these are actually paper, um, paper tassel. So uh, it's, it's a little bit more than I wanted to spend, but I, I wanted to see how this is made because I've never made tassel before. And I just bought a, um, fringe scissors based on my friend's recommendation, uh, Karen with Yes Please Paper Craft. So I figure I'm going to try and use this as a sample as well to do that. I saw these, these were everything paper steel is 50% uh, off this week. So I thought these were super, super cute um, for $2.50, originally $5. Um, these gummy bears, gummy bears is my favorite snack, one of my favorite snacks. So I thought these were so cute. Um, again, $5, two fifty on sale this week. I got this really pretty tassel with with an unusual weaving here. Originally four dollars on clearance for a dollar, and I think there was one more. Where is it? Okay, yeah, actually two more. This one was also on clearance. I think some of you have seen this before. I love this color. This is um, in a silver tone, gorgeous, very kind of year year gone by type style, and um, and then I I found these really sweet message in a bottle type uh, charm thingy. I don't know what they're called exactly. Yeah, charm thingy. <laughs> That's a good name for it. And they say, family, happy, be kind, forever, me and you and shine. And um, these, I haven't opened it yet, but I'm 100% sure that these can be open and you can fill them up with glitter or little um, sequins and, and confetti and things like that. That'll make it super, super cute. I think even doing an ombre effects of some glitter and pack it tight so it doesn't move around would be so pretty in here too. So those are my kind of jewelry finds and jewelry splurge. It wasn't really much of a splurge. And then the other thing, I, I never, I have so much ribbons, so many ribbons. So I, I try not to go there, <laughs> but today I couldn't help myself. So I just went to check it out and they had some really cute one on clearance. So I got this one originally $8, now $2. And it's just so pretty. Look at the floral on that. Isn't that sweet? I, I love it. So, I mean, you can cut out the wire if you want to. You can punch it and maybe even make some bows if you want to. All of these that I got, I think I'm going to try to make some bows out of them as well because they're fabric. Um, so that was a great deal. This one was uh, $5, now $124. And again, this glitter doesn't come off. Um, and it's like a fabric, you know, and it's all 
red, white, and blue almost make some great punch, star punch or bows and things like that that you can make for the upcoming July 4th, but also, um, you know, whenever you have anything kind of like Labor Day and Memorial Day and so on. I thought this was so pretty. This was originally $4, now reduced to a dollar. And you can cut these out. You can make different strips with, and they're little tiny, um, tiny hearts. You know, the heart is in the color, the rainbow colors, and then you have clear, clear, um, whatchamacallit, clear uh, crystal in between. And they're so pretty, don't you think? Oh my gosh, I'm just in love. Um, that was such a good deal too. And then I got this one. I love this pattern. It was $6, now $1.50. And it's just, it's got kind of like a, it's a gold. It could be kind of, yeah, it's a gold. It's not really a rose gold, but I think it's just gorgeous. And again, very fabric-like. So I think I'm going to try to make some bows out of that as well. I'm going to move these out of the way. And then my last bow um, acquisition is, uh-oh, I just dropped all my bows behind my tables. Um, and these are like a real pretty shimmer, um, material very plasticky i mean like it looks like fabric again i think some bows would be really pretty on this or just just a, a strip maybe cut it out a little bit to make it a little bit smaller so that's that and then the rest of this haul um is going to be just on cards um i i'm gonna start with these because they're kind of bulky so i want to take them out of the table have you ever seen these um you know, th this actually wasn't even, I never, I've already met, been married for a long time, so I never go to the, to the wedding um, section, but actually they move all these to the clearance section. So that's how I saw them. And um, these, they come in a box like this, and, you know, and so on, but it's, I took the box apart because I just couldn't deal. It was just too much. And it basically, wedding programs that there's 50 of them and they're a trifold, a trifold card. So, I mean, oh my God, it's like you can make mini albums on this, glue the flaps together. I mean, that's so many things, you know, how slimline card is super in right now. This is exactly the size of a slimline card. If you just cut off this panel, this third panel. So it's like, oh, I can't stand it loving it and that was all of the wedding invitations uh, was thirty dollars now they're three dollars and this has 50 of them in there Ugh, unbelievable um anyway so that's that then i got this really cute really gorgeous actually very classy looking invitations that is um just an open flap like this you could use it this way or this way um, beautiful emboss um, filigree and so on and uh, these were actually only 25 and so it's reduced to 250 everything was like uh, you know 90% uh, off and this have all of the invitation I think have 25 invitations the program had more and it come with a beautiful matching envelope in silver foil and then look at the back oh my goodness so pretty and this one does not have a lining because it has this beautiful background and then it came also with 25 um what do you call this rsvp card or whatever and they always give you the the how to print and you know how to to judge the the text and stuff like that so i mean if you don't want to use it as cards you can actually put you can take a stamp put any any um sentiment on here and that could be your thank you card to your clients it could be a, a little note to your friend hello whatever um or you can just cut it out and use it as a journaling journaling bits on your scrapbook page but uh, just plain card just plain card but very good size to use as well so that's um that was amazing deal so if you think it's basically 10 cents for each of the set i just show you right i mean even if you don't use anything and you just use these slimline um cards envelope that is worth the price <laughs> so anyway i love that um actually this one i got it to fit in here so everything can go um 
you know, neatly in my drawer. There you go. Okay. And then I got this really, really nice set of, uh, again, I threw out the box on this because I condensed it to with another one. And this one basically come with, look how gorgeous this is. This is the actual, um, I, I won't show that first. This is the, the um, sheets that it comes with. Yeah, just plain, nice cardstock, not too thick, not too thin. Have these beautiful um, kind of a, a, a antique gold um, writing on it. It came with this trifold envelope thing with a pocket here. So you can slide this bit in there. It came with its uh, came with the envelopes, of course, and the envelope has a beautiful antique gold lining inside. It even came with because, as you can see in the example, it came with a uh, pearl closure that you can, and even with the circle um, glue dot pop up dot, so that you can attach it to the envelope. And then it came, of course, with the um, not of course, but it came with the RSVP as well, and you know, print on both sides. You can even use this as a as a background for a five by seven cards or something like that. And then a beautiful frame out um, half of that, which which is wonderful. You can use journaling card. You can use it as an embellishment for a tag, whatever, right? And um, they always give you an example. Um, and yeah, they come. They come like this. So they always have this invitation text sheet that, that tell you how to do it. That's what they do with these self-made, you know, in, invitation. These were 30, so on sale for $3 or clearance. And then they always give you an example of what it looks like once you put it all together. So it's kind of nice. They have the RSVP card in there as well. And then there you go. You stick it in the envelope and you are done. Oh, gorgeous! so in love with this um, and again you can use it to make mini albums to just tear it apart and use it just use the embellishment i don't care for three dollars that's what normally just the pearl beads thing 25 counts would cost you um, and then the last wedding invitation one i got were these um beautiful one so it came with the um the the, the card itself it's it's background on both sides, folded to a five by seven card, I think. Um, yeah, five by seven card. And then this is a vellum. Yeah, you can see a beautiful vellum on here. And then a silver foil um, background card. And they even gives you the glue, the glue strip. These are strip that you can put all of these together as well as blings that you can use to um, uh, embellishing it up and the end the matching envelope that is beautiful and look at the front okay and then they basically this and then of course the RSVP card as well again printed on both sides so if you don't use it as a card you can cut it in half and use it that way and again a matching envelope for the RSVP too and then they give you an example on how to put it together this is what you do two strips of this on here actually I probably would just do one strip and um and then you see the glue that they use to to um, to do that. And then you put the other strip of glue behind here to glue this part on the um, invitation. Amazing! I love it. And so these, I actually got rid of the one box because it just doesn't fit in my um, drawer unit. But this two, I was able to squeeze it in and everything fit nicely in there for me to use when I'm ready to use it. And I always keep these with the price and stuff because I want to remember what a good deal and what a good shopper I was. <laughs> there you go. Um, okay, now let me go through the, these. These thank you card, I found it. It's a set of almost 50. They're five, five by five by four and a quarter. So the regular, I think that's A2 size. It was $8 on sale for two for 50 cards. So what is that? Two, that's four cents each or something like that. Is that right? 
yeah, four cents each. And it's just a plain gold foil thank you card um, with a plain envelope. But I plan to, you know, add some embellishment on here, maybe a little heart, a little flower, things that you have in your stash. And I send a thank you card out. And I didn't make one per se for special for my business or anything like that. I have a small business selling different um, lady accessories and makeup and skincare and jewelry and things like that but I always send a thank you card with every order I get from my client so um, these always come in handy and that's a nice stack and it's very plain very classy but again you can embellish it up as you wish okay um, so that's a nice set and then let me go through the rest of them for you now these are much much lower in price they come in the party section but i'd never go to the party section either and so these were from the um the clearance section they were most of them were five dollars on sale for one 124 and basically it's like 75 percent off or whatever and look how cute this is perfect for summer uh, again i don't even care if i use this per se but look at the gorgeous pink pink is my favorite color um with the little pineapple this if you want to embellish the middle and do something so you don't have to say it's party time all the time but i just thought for that price for 10 of them all of them come in set of 10 um literally they're 12 cents each uh 13 cents each if you wanted to say that and um that's how it goes and i always store this in the back so that way when i cut it up really flush out to to the um to the, the 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 size of the card and um i'll show you at the end how i store these cards uh card blank so that you can we can use it um i found these things i just never looked at cards and stuff because i have so many card blanks from michael's and and you know from uh, just yeah just the main card blank that i typically use but this was like come on 23 cents from five dollars this was like super clearance and i love movies um so this is just perfect i mean even if you don't use it for something that say movie night you could just cut this out at the edge and just use it as a beautiful frame for um for a photo or drilling bit or whatever and then the envelope look, check that out awesome gold foil with stars and the front looked like a ticket stub like that okay so that was an amazing deal as well and then um i found another one that was about movies and things and it comes like this it's um it's the same it's the same price it's like 23 cents i think i threw away the thing the price thingy but it came with the party thingy again you can cut it out and just use it as a frame um it came with a little look like a popcorn um baggie right and you insert it like this it is um pattern on both sides you can use that as a background paper too if you, you if you like this is the envelope beautiful front and back and inside so it's it's amazing and that's how you put it together um so awesome don't you think oh my god i'm so in love with all of these um okay then the next one i like this a lot i've always wanted to be wanted by the law <laughs> don't you and your, your inner bad girl come out um these were a dollar 25 about or so and it has this beautiful you know um deco edge with um with what do you call this you know like almost like you inked it um very vintage age look to it and even the envelope look like it's been burned um by a little fire and so on so it, it's just gorgeous and you know if you don't want these cowboy boots stick something else in the front you know or use it as a junk journal envelope junk journal whatever they're just lovely for for the price you get for that um okay and then the next one i kind of um put them in categories a little bit so make it a little bit easier oops sorry i just hit my camera um this one again was six dollars reduced to 150 and these were superheroes for for 10 of them you get this calling all superheroes if you don't want to say the word calling just sticks a big star on it or something 
but I thought it was so cool. And you can even fussy cut these out. You know, these, what do you call these bubble that say bam, wham, whatever. You can put that right on top here too. Um, Recollections I have in my stash, a um, Comic Heroes um, paper pad from Recollection that had a bunch of these things and these would make great embellishment for that. But look how cute the the invitation is oh my god even the skyline where batman was you know sitting up there and even that you can just use that as a background if you don't think that you can use the card itself but for 15 cents a set it was a great deal um okay so then the next one is i have a i have some friends that are in the uh, armed force client as well so i thought it's a good thing for me to grab one of these um just in case i want to make cards for them or whatever but these are all again it's five it's five dollars <laughs> reduced to 23 cents and just the envelope i would love look how cute this is oh my god um and so on and then they say you've been recruited you can actually you know get rid of this part by um putting something else on top but i thought that was just an amazing um, deal as well okay so that's kind of all kind of stuff that we um put it here that is kind of i don't know a little bit off the wall a little uh, uh, as such so now i'm gonna go to um actually just go to babies yeah i found these um cards that literally they come with this it's a gender reveal party again you don't have to use it as that just use it the paper itself that's a beautiful ivory color very nice very thick card stock it comes with a you know the insert it's actually like a little envelope thingy you can take it apart use it as a background paper cut cut this out and put your photos in the middle whatever and look how cute the envelope is oh god golly look at this i mean come on you guys um and this was a dollar 25 reduced from five dollars and um it's you know here's it put together already there for you but so beautiful and so reasonable um to uh, to use so anyway that's that and then the next one is um so i don't usually most of my clients are female so I don't usually get any thank you cards, things that are mail related, but these were from the baby section, I suppose, but I found them all in the clearance section. But I do have a few male clients, so I think this is appropriate for me to get it. Um, it is just a cute little envelope with a thank you card in blue, um, and it was 74 cents, reduced from $3. So amazing deal, alrighty. I have that and then the baby the baby invitation that came with it was um it was uh five dollars reduced to 15 cents how can i leave that behind right i mean just uh, just uh, anyway um it comes with a, a very nice cardstock say it's a boy again i would just fussy cut that out or stick something else on there and use it as paper or a card front it come with these so cute belly band um with the baby feet on it and so on that you just go like that if you wanted to use it as a real invitation which i will not be i'm not having a boy anytime soon uh another boy i mean and uh, the envelope has some sweet sweet um you know lining and the little feet in the front as well so again i would cover that up and just leave the back um and that's this is what it's supposed to look like if you want to use it as as a true invitation but i think it's so so cute um for for the price okay for what was it 15 cents yippee all right so now let's look at some another set of something blue and for boys um this one has actually i liked so much i bought two sets this one also originally six dollars reduced to 23 cents and it's a mr wonderful i think that's so cute and again i would fussy cut this out use it as a frame as a whatever the background of this is a nice uh blue blue blood and look at the envelope oh my gosh so cute i mean i would even use that you know as a background of something you know as a frame of of your photos or whatever same with this side i mean there's so many things you could do that it's like not even funny um 
Um, so that's why I have two of these because I bought two sets. And then and now we go to the baby girl section. I found these cute thank you cards that I, for 74 cents from $3 and beautiful uh, envelope. And the, um, oh, I have it right here. The invitation, I see, I'm so prepared and so good. I didn't want to, I took all these things apart because I didn't want it to wrinkle and make all the noise for you. Um, but this is, it's all gold foil, gold polka dot on floral, pink floral on both sides. Super, super cute for the price and very useful. So I plan to use that to send um, thank you cards to my clients when I, when they place orders. Um, okay, so then this one is the invitation that coordinate with that set. Again, I will not be using it as an invitation, but I can fussy cut this out, made a frame out of it. I can actually use this as a sentiment for a baby um, card, but look at the envelope too. Gorgeous, right? I mean, it, it goes all the way to the end. So if you want to take it apart, this is an actual background that you can use. So it's like... Oh my god. And I you can always use a beautiful ivory color cardstock the size of a five by seven cards. Um these were a dollar from four dollar um originally priced. Okay, so that's that. Then I found these set for originally six dollars down to twenty-three cents. And these comes like this. It has a card like that, and then it comes with a bunch of these cross die cut with a with a bow that you can loop through here you see the little slit here and you can loop through and made a, a bow in the front for that and this is the matching envelope so it has these beautiful doesn't have anything inside but it has these beautiful thing in the in the flap and basically this is what you made it's a baptism announcement um thing but i don't plan to use that for that since both of my kids have already been baptized already been baptized a while back and but that's i think it's darling and the die cut and the ribbon i mean oh come on and this was also yeah i already told you i think 23 cents um was what it was so amazing right um so while i have you here let me talk through a little bit about how no don't forget it i'll do that at the end all right so that's that now we have some birthday invitation stuff which is, um, um, I think it's super good. This one actually is not even the birthday. Um, actually, I do want to show you, where is that thing? I do wanted to show you, um, I don't know if I should share this because you can say, oh my God, I, you may lose all respect for me because I can be kind of anal about things. So, um, you know, you notice how these things, when they flap it on to um, when the clerk slap it on to the sale price thing it drive me nuts when it's crooked like that so i always take my really thin uh knife that that it was not it was a kitchen knife that, that part of a set or something like that but it works so well and then i straighten it up because I, I can't stand it so that's what i do and then you know how these these type of um, set usually it's in a classy envelope. I left this one on so I can show it to you. So the price of the item is there, but when they slap the sale price on, it's outside of the bag. So what I what I like to do is I like to keep track of how much um, things cost for me. So again, I take my I love this knife. I have two of these, and oh my god, one time I lost one and I was dying because it was like every time I had to walk to the other section of the. Um, of my uh, my room in order to uh, get the one but now I, I found the other one so now they be, the one is in my couch area where I do some stuff and then one at my craft table so now what I do is I stick it right next to the original price right there straight and then um, that become you know so even later on if I want to throw this away it's the price and everything is still there but look how pretty this set is okay so you have basically a card fund with some uh what do you call these leaf uh leaf wreath oh my gosh that's a tongue twister over some wood panel or shiplap it's so pretty so cute you just go like that and then a um, simple white um envelope five by seven size it's just i think it make great 
background for your cards for your embellishment on a scrapbook page whatever very farmhousey okay so that was uh, five dollars originally reduced to 125 then i found this your invited invitation thing i love this part i think it's like even if you don't use this, I would be able to cut it out. I, I would find some ways to use it. And you have this whole background here that you can use as a background paper or background for your cards and stuff. So you don't need to worry that, um, you know, you don't have this part. So um, I think that's wonderful. And look at the lining for this card. Oh my God. And this lining just go to here, but it doesn't matter. I would keep it together. Um, like that and this have this it actually meant to have that because all of the envelope have that so it's not damaged or anything i don't think because it was not hitting to onto anything that causes that but um i don't doesn't matter to me and this was um a dollar 24 okay so then i found this crazy crazy imitation it say let's glow crazy so like good imitations for those uh shoot shoot the i don't know what they're called my my kids used to love going to these parties or hosting these parties but i thought this would be good for me to use these beautiful colorful strip to cut out banners for that they already very nice cardstock um and so on because again i'm not planning to do any kind of these kind of parties and then look at the paint balls yeah paint balls um this one go all the way to the bottom so if you don't want to use it as an envelope you can just cut it apart and use it as a background okay for something and that was a dollar fifty from six dollars again all of these come in set of ten um then i found this funky and it look like slime doesn't it it's an it's not on both sides but the black on the on the back and it's just open like that and it has all these weird sloopy sloppy thingy in different colors be fun to just fussy cut that out too you're invited in this funky color as well it's kind of almost glow in the dark as well and i just think it's so cute I'm, I'm sure i will find ways to use this and look at this gorgeous gorgeous envelope i mean oh my gosh and this go all the way to the back to the bottom so again if you don't use the front which why wouldn't you it's so slimy and cute um you can cut it out and use the the back of the envelope as well and this was five dollars reduced to 125 so amazing price too okay and then I found this set. This set comes like this. This is all velvet. Okay, so it's raised velvet, gorgeous. I would, if I use it as a frame, I would just trim it down a little bit because it may be uh, too much or I trim it down like that and use the, two, the bit on the outside as another frame. Um, and it comes, it's just white. It's a kind of a nice large size. What is this size? It's like uh, eight and a half by five and a half. And um, the envelope is like this. So it doesn't have anything in the inside, but the front is, um, what do you call it, that frame like that. And this is an example of um, the birthday party that they printed out. Okay, so that's so cute. I This you can definitely use as an invitation because it's very neutral tone, very grown up like. But if you don't use it for an invitation, it can be used in so many different things. Um, that you have okay so stick that back oh and that was five dollars in price reduced to 69 cents okay amazing oh i love this next one check this out okay first of all it's 69 cents from six dollars i don't know what percentage that is but it almost 90 percent this is an example of the card you you can make so it comes in a very neutral very easy to use card front you can do you can you know if you want to make it smaller just do the the um, diagonal cut here at the end and that way you can move it up and down anywhere you want to make exactly the size of frame you want and check this out oh my god you know how those wobbly thingy that you buy to make your um embellishment do crazy things that's what this is and you are provided with 10 of these to make your party it party thing go nuts okay and i would just use it in my scrapbook layout and then here's the um uh, what do you call it um, envelope um the inside is just black 
with the stripes here and the outside is this funky, very safari, um, wall side type, um, type uh, pattern. Okay, so that was awesome, isn't it? Oh, I love it. And for 69 cents, come on. All right. And then I got um, this beautiful, this I, I left it in the package because I actually bought two. Um, it's $1.50 from $6. And I just love, love this um, holographic rainbow. I don't know if it shows up on the in the um, on the video, but it's very pretty. You can see different shades of the whole rainbow from yellow, green, turquoise, purple, pink, orange, red, yellow, and go back to green. Um, gorgeous. So I plan to just cut this out, put it on the sentiment on a card, has this beautiful, the same rainbow stripes on there in foil, and then the um, the inside, <laughs> look at that. But it's just, it could just go to there. So again, if you want to, you can just cut that out and use it, but why? You know, you can just use that for that. Um, I, lovely, $1.50 from $6. And then I found the matching treat bags for it. It's just a simple treat bag. You get 24 bags for a dollar from $4. And again, I was, I don't plan to use it as a treat bag. We don't throw birthday parties anymore for the kids, but I think it's just cute to do happy mails. You use it for happy mails or just simply cut it out and use it as a sentiment on your card or your um, scrapbook layout. Okay. So that is that. It's not, it's like, oh my God, I, I'm so sorry this is taking, oh, this is taking so long to do, but I mean, can you blame me? I had to buy them all because they're so pretty. And then this last um, stack is some cute invitation. I got this um, $5 reduced to, to, no, I'm sorry. This one is um, $5 reduced to $125. And it's just a sweetest invitation for whatever. It's like a party or whatever. And I mean, and it has a little notch that you can tuck that in. You can, uh, I mean, I would just fussy cut this out. I would use it as a, as a mini album cover, whatever. It's, it's so cute. And look at the envelope that comes with that. It goes all the way to the bottom. So you can cut that out if you want. But the front is super cute with a little queen crown on that. Um, I love, love, love it. Um, okay, so then that's that. Then I have a very, uh, very, very sweet invitation that I got for $1.50, originally $5. Look at what it comes with. It comes with a cute, cute invitation page. Again, you can use it for whatever you like. And then this little polka dot pockets. Oh my God, it's so cute. Look at that, right? You stick this thing in. And here's the invitation, uh, the envelope. And again, it's go. Uh, it does not go all the way, but you can cut it out if you like to use it that way. The front doesn't have anything there. And this is how you put it together. You know, if you want to use it as an invitation, but I, I probably won't, because this can be just super sweet to use and embellish a little bit and use it as a uh, tuck in your little journaling bed for your scrapbook page or the base of another card to make. So I thought that was um, amazing. And this was 23 cents from $5. <laughs> it's crazy, crazy, crazy. And then this one is super cute too. Look how cute the invite is. You know, you can use it either way. The, the back is this color, the polka dot pink, so tone on tone. So you can even use that as a background paper if you want to, you don't, you don't, if you don't like the hot pink and the black and white stripe, but why wouldn't you? And then it comes with a envelope for that. Look at how gorgeous that is. So you would tuck it in, I'll show you in a second. And then the envelope that comes with that is pink on the back and the black and white stripe in the inside. Oh my God, I love it. And look, that's all you do is just stick it in and there you go. You can use it separate, you can use it together. I absolutely adore this. This was a little, that's probably the priciest one I have. It's $1.74, originally I think it was $7.99 or $8, okay? But it comes with all of that stuff. And then the last one is so cute. It's a, um, it was $5 reduced to $125. And um, it's basically a, don't miss the party. 
it got a donut i plan to just cut it i love we love donuts i don't love to eat it i just like to look at it it's so pretty and with sprinkle and things and i love all the donuts embellishment that we have but it's just in the back it's just a beautiful sprinkle background you can use it that way or you could just cut out the donut and and do like a little tuck um you know on your on your donut page whatever you want it i just got some donut washi tape too i can't wait to use that and then this pay uh, this line will go all the way to the bottom if you don't want to use it as an envelope for anything but it's so cute it's make a great envelope for a, a party any kind of party that you could do and that was i think i told you the price already a dollar 25 from five bucks okay so that is all the invitations i don't know which one this go to um all the invitation i got from hobby lobby but then i'm gonna do a second part of this haul that go over all the paper crafting kit but i just want to show you real quick the way i um store these kind of cards i i don't separate them out or anything i don't re even remove the classing what i do is i do cut out usually it comes longer because usually that's they do like this they they uh, clamp that and they staple it so i take the staple out nicely so i actually take my um knife and just peel off the thing so i don't rip this part because i do save this and that way this come out nicely i don't rip the classing bag and then i simply cut the extra so then what i do is i have these free uh, basically they're free boxes that i got when i purchased my juice plus from one of my best friends um caprice cree bar so if you don't know anything about juice plus or um wanted to learn more about it you know dm me or or leave me a message and i will give you the information on how to contact caprice it's it's she's been doing it forever she knows everything and she's just the sweetest person so basically i just do it like this and voila you're all finished and these these thing comes with it so i'll show you the I'll show you the um, the juice plus how it comes. Okay, so these are the gummy bears one. This is the one that my kids take, and um, it's like this. So it's it's really nice. It's seven seven by eight and a half. I already measured it, and the depth is four and a half. And then when you open it, this is how they come. This is all the fruit thirty fruit fruit and vegetables that you um, that you need for the day when you eat two of those. Depends on the age. Sometimes you eat four, sometimes you eat two. Depends on how old your kids are. And these are also, these are fruits and these are vegetables. Okay. And they are fresh frozen. So um, you don't lose any nutrient. You know how vegetables, if you boil them and stuff like that, they, they go bad. I mean, not go bad, but all the nutrient de die. So these allow you to keep everything. They flash froze, fro fresh, flash freeze it. And then they grind it into um, these, or con concentrate it down to, from, to the juice. And for adults, um, you can get them, or adults or kids that don't care for ju uh, for chewable, um, you can get these in capsule, capsule way. Um, same thing, okay? So I take two of the fruit and two of the vegetable every day. And then this is what, um, what they look like when it's empty. So it's super nice. The cardboard is very thick. Okay, so I simply take my uh, knife, my craft knife, and I just do a nice cut here with my ruler, my, my metal ruler. And then, um, I, or actually I even, what I normally do is I even fold this down here just to give the side, I don't even cut that out. I cut this one out, but I do it like this. When I cut this out, actually you could also cut this out and then take, take the slightly smaller one and line it in the bottom to make the box even um, sturdier if you like. I, I like to do that. And then simply I just took some scrap of paper that I had. I had so many of these gorgeous me and my big idea um, scrapbook paper so i just cut it out the panels to the size of the box and i just line it up and make it you know so it's pretty and and not unsightly and this gets stored in my in my um um ikea uh, packs unit that's i'll show you that later in my um craft room tour all right, so that's how I do all of these cards blank because I don't need to go into them very often, but I do know, and 
I, in a separate place. I do have things separated out in a certain way so that I can find them again. But I have a whole bunch of these um, these bins that I stored like this. Okay. All right. And that's it for this video. I'm so sorry it took so long. I'm. Uh, if you stay until the end, thank you so much. And if you like this kind of content, uh, my channel is brand new. I, um, I plan to do uh, crafty hauls but also scrapbooking process, planning processes, um, card making process or card making stuff and um, uh, organization ideas and stuff like that too. So if you liked it, please subscribe or hit the like button and I will see you next time. Bye for now.